Hey, hey guys. Alright, let me show you guys how to finally root your LG Optimus V. The files you will need will be down below. They're down below. So you guys can do this real quick. Alright, basically, it, it's going to be really simple. It's not exactly hard. But, I've said that before and I've gotten tons of emails about people you know, having problems with it. But, okay, this phone, you shouldn't have any problems with Like the um, Samsung... In intercept because the cord you know they sent out with the uh, phone wasn't a data cord it was a charging cord only so that's why you couldn't you know really get data through this cord alright guys now that we are back on the computer from now on you shouldn't need your phone from now on but alright what you're going to do now is you're going to uh, double click super one uh, Super one click dot exe. Yeah, sorry. And here you're going to click root, and you're going to get this weird texting stuff in this box. You know, just let it run. And when it gets to reading OS version properties, you can exit out of it because you're not going to need it anymore. And now what you're going to do is you're going to go and open up. Here, let me exit it out so it's going to be easier. Go up and search CMD, enter, and you want to type in CMD desktop backspace the file that you put super one click root in. And then you're going to type in ABD, or actually, yeah, ABD, uh, actually, before you do this, I'm sorry. Uh, you're going to go in here, and you should be able to see two Sioux versions. Right-click on one of them, hit rename, and you just want to put in Sioux, S-U. That's all you're going to have to put in there. Now, go back to, to the CMD, type in ABD, uh, space shell, let it run again. Okay. Now, you should have this icon right here. If you have this icon right here, the second one, you need to redo it again because you do not have a shell root right now. Alright. So the first thing you're, you're going to uh, copy, which I also have, have down below, is copy uh, mount o, whatever this is, and then paste it in, and hit enter, and then type exit. Okay, after this, you're going to copy ABD, push, sue, so on and so forth. Oh. Uh, and then copy, and it should transfer over. After that, you're going to copy the one, you know, I'm going to basically just copy and paste it in as it goes. And then, this is about it, really. There's nothing else more. Copy them, you know, as an order. Uh, after that, you're going to go into CD... Or, you know, basically just copy it so it's easier for you guys, so you guys don't, um, mess anything up. Paste, enter. Everything should go smoothly as I'm doing right now. Exit. And now you're going to type in ABD, reboot, and we're going to go back to your phone. And uh, I'm going to show you guys how you guys can tell, um, if the phone is rooted or not. So, let's go back to the phone. Alright guys, now that we're back on the phone, you can go ahead and unlock it. And what you're going to want to do, is you're going to want to go to Market. And you're going to, uh, uh, sorry, allergies are killing me again. Alright, so you're going to go up and you're going to type in, uh, Super User. Oops. User. Okay. You're going to type that, and then hit go, and it should be the first one up top that you see, no it's not it, this one right here, if I change DD, this one right here, install that, hit open install, and then once you get it done, to check it, okay, now what you're going to do is, when you want to uh, you know check it, you can always go... Uh, on the market again, which I should have already. You want to go and, and, and you want to type in root, oops, root, no, evil, root checker, or root check. No. Yeah, give me that. Alright. You're going to type in root check. Hit go. And it's going to be. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I, have, I already have it installed. 
It should just come up. There we go. By this guy, Joey Krim, awesome, awesome programmer. And you go in and install it. Now, when, when done installing, you're going to hit, hit auto update, hit open, and you're going to see this. Now, so the first thing you want to do is, 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 is verify that you have, oh yeah, let me get out of that so you guys don't be like, why is yours different from mine? Okay. Click, uh, verify it, and it should say, congratulations, you have root access. And now after that, you're going to hit verify box, and it says you have that correctly. Now, so you guys know, before you do this, we, uh, you have to install super user first for it to work properly. Let me give you an example of what it does. Just hit forget. Alright. Now, when you first install a program, and, and, and it does need super user uh, rights. Like for example, let me show you real quick. Hit verify boot. And then you're, and then you will get this. Just click allow, and that's it. All right, guys. Uh, that's it for how to root your LG Optimus V for Virgin Mobile. Um, right now, there's really no ROMs or you know like overclock kernels for it right now, uh, because the kernel source is still not released yet. So just give it time, and and. I'm sure, you know, they will release it or something. So, yeah. Alright, guys. That's about it. Uh, comment, rate, subscribe. If you guys need any help, let me know. I'm always here. Alright, guys. See you later. Bye.